Yo, welcome to the video. This is Racer J <clears throat> in the office, and as you can see, today is a little bit horrible on the weather front. It is uh, Tuesday, the 12th of December 2023, and the time is about one o'clock now, just after one o'clock in the afternoon. So, leaving Bradford. And on the way to uh, Hesham Docks near Morecambe up the M6. So, uh, as you can see, this is the uh, this is what you get now and then the reality of trucking, all kinds of different weather conditions. And it's not just sunshine and uh, open roads. It is serious and different road situations, weather situations. And uh, if you're thinking about being a trucker, I hope you can watch this and uh, just get enough insight with it really to see what it is like. I was going to use that camera up there but I've, uh, I think I've misplaced the uh, micro SD card so I can't record anything onto it. So unfortunately, we've just got this view. Um, so, hope you don't mind that. But yeah. Okay, hi guys and welcome back. I'm in Hesham Docks and I'm going to show you uh, an uncoupling. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, please, uh, please keep this quiet. I don't think I'm meant to be recording in here, so uh, we're going to be as quick as we can. All right. So what we want to do first is uh, the black process, which is brakes, legs, airlines kingpin and dog clip so we'll go around to the parking brake put that on your legs gotta wind these down and obviously it's been wet and raining I've just got mud on myself now so you gotta be careful when it's like this By the way, in Manchester, the weather was actually surprisingly nice. The sky is a bit cloudy, but it's blue like it is here, and it's not raining like it is here, so that's good. Now, this is the big stuff. We're disconnecting all our electric lines and airlines and such. So you want to disconnect each one in order. Try not to make anything tangled. Disconnect the ABS lead and the final brake line. So we've done brakes, the legs, the airlines, etc. And we are coming to the final disconnection, which is your kingpin and dog clip. So that dog clip is released. Kingpin now can be released. And there, there we are. So that's ready ready to disconnect or decouple so I'll do that now get it in gear so what you want to do have your uh, suspension 
remote in your hand then you want to creep forward slightly so that's now disconnected then you can start lowering the suspension so as you lower it obviously it disconnects further and you clear the trailer without any sudden movements because you don't want to be going too fast because you could damage your legs and damaging the legs on a trailer is not good so that's fully past it now and I'm completely disconnected now so now I can raise up the suspension back to normal levels and that's it that's done by the way if you're wondering about the number plate I did really I did take off the number plate and I have stored it away so that's the job that's done for now so now uh, I'll get back to so we'll get back to recording once I have uh, arrived at my second location which is to collect a trailer all right see you then all right guys welcome to this part of the video so as you can see it's a TGX 26.460 MAN anyway we're here to collect this trailer here first thing you want to do walk around what you normally do walk around do a check make sure the tires visual check really make sure there's no damage to the treads make sure all these uh wheel nut markers are there so you've got to do that each and every tire uh checking the tread so yeah you do all that make sure you've got the right trailer of course the trailer number matches check the uh bodywork etc no sharp edges so that's what you're gonna do and it's always best to check the parking brake is on before you connect so we're happy with that now we are gonna couple up to this trailer so get all your lights on get into gear reverse gear again because you're reversing you want to do it slowly you want to make sure that you've got hold of your um suspension uh remote so you can lower that to the desired height you would do it from the outside but i'm just getting it to a level that I know I can get under there and then once you're under it you want to raise it to its maximum height there we go so you'll hear that click that means you've connected the kingpin to the pin on the trailer give it a quick tug test little acceleration and there we go that's connected okay so this next stage you want your light on off obviously if it's dark your rear light for your uh, airlines and Susie's etc so I'll get my gloves on and firstly you're checking your you're clipping your dog clip to the kingpin if you can see that I don't know if you can hope you can so that's this clip here on and we'll clip that through that hole which you might have seen there you go that's connected that's not moving now so if any emergency that's not going to be the cause of a fault if there is a problem but anyway that's connected next so we're working black backwards brakes legs airlines kingpin dog clip so we're just on the kingpin connected up or coupled dog clip 
connected now it's the airlines okay so when you're ready to leave guys simple as this let this fella pass put ignition on we'll turn her on it's ready to roll lights on make sure you're in gear ready to go it's a little bit tricky because uh, you have trailers to the side of you there but managed to get out nicely as we should do and there we go switch off my hazards now I'm no longer a hazard Alright, thanks for watching guys, leave a like if you like, let me know what you think, peace.